Let's talk about the lentils. I'm using these red lentils. They're actually sort of orange in color and I soaked them in water for about half an hour. That's because I don't wanna cook them until they're al dente. I wanna cook them until they're fall apart tender because this is going to be something like a soup in consistency. So that just helps all along the process a little bit. So I'm throwing two cups of water, about a cup of lentils together in a saucepan. I'm gonna add my onions to it. This dish is so delicious. I mean, I know that sometimes people think lentils aren't very exciting, but there is nothing dull about these lentils, let me tell you. They just explode with flavor in your mouth. They're this gorgeous, warm, orangey color. I'm gonna get my tomatoes in my lentils. This was two medium tomatoes. Here we go. See if I can't drop them. <laughs> and once the lentils come to a boil, I'm gonna let them simmer for about 40 minutes covered so they get nice and tender. I'm also gonna take some of this garlic with me, about four cloves and a tablespoon of minced ginger. It's a lot of garlic, I know, but this is Indian food. <laughs> we use a lot of garlic and it's really, really good for you. So I'm just give this a stir and now don't salt it. I found that if you salt your lentils, they're gonna take even longer to cook. So just let them be. The last thing I'm gonna throw in here is a serrano pepper. Looks like this. And all I'm gonna do is slit it down the middle like this, not the whole way even. So you're just gonna get this really gentle serrano pepper flavor with a little bit of heat, but not a ton. So what I'm doing is I'm making an infused oil and the word we use for it is bagar. We're gonna bagar these lentils. <laughs> so the way that we do that is I'm gonna build two levels of flavor here. And I'm gonna start with seeds, half a teaspoon of whole cumin seeds and half a teaspoon of brown or black mustard seeds, whole. I'm gonna use some turmeric and paprika. Okay, those are all ready to go. So I'm gonna add my seeds to my oil and have a lid handy because sometimes it'll splutter at you. See how that's happening and is it beautiful? Okay, it's not so pretty when I get it all over me. And then add your spices. Isn't that beautiful? And then grab a towel because your pan will be hot. Swirl it around a little bit. When you add spices to oil, they really open up. And then here's the big dramatic finish. Are you ready? <laughs> Isn't that cool? Sometimes there's nothing cuter than a bowl of soup, right? Look how beautiful that is, right? I'm gonna finish it with just a little fresh chopped cilantro. And you know, when you're using cilantro, you can use the soft stems too. Lots of great flavor in there. You don't have to pick the leaves off.